Big news coming in. People are starting to call out pro-Hamas rallies that are being taken out in the Western world. U.S. Member of Parliament, Sri Thanedar, has announced that he's renouncing his membership in the Democratic Socialists of America after the group's New York City chapter promoted a rally in the Times Square in support of what appears to be pro-Palestine. But it was at a time when Israel was facing murder, killings, hostage crisis and much worse. This has drawn condemnation from uh, public officials and these were rallies, remember, that were seen in different parts of the world that on the day when Hamas extremists killed Israelis and other nationalities, there were some rallies taken out in the name of pro-Palestine, but it also appeared to be pro-Hamas. Sri Thanedar is now joining me uh, live on this. and. Uh, there, we, we saw those visuals, uh, Sri Thanedar, of not just at the Times Square, but of other rallies that were taken out, some even cheering and jeering at the deaths that had taken place. You tell us about this SDA chapter. What exactly happened? Well, you know, people need to realize what exactly happened. This is terrorism. You know, terrorists entered uh, the, the state of Israel and, yes. uh, you know, killed babies, killed, uh, uh, you know, elderly, uh, kidnapped uh, elderly, and they are held them hostage. Uh, this is an act of terrorism. And there are rallies that are trying to glorify these terrorists as uh, uh, freedom fighters or as a resistance movement or, you know, uh, and that is totally wrong. And that is the reason why um, as a United States congressman, uh, it's like a member of parliament in mm. India, right? Mm. So as a United States congressman, I have disavowed and, uh, uh, you know, renounced my membership of this democratic uh, socialist organization, DSA, uh, for organizing such a rally uh, to, uh, you know, glorify terrorists, essentially and uh, ignoring the fact that uh, they have done atrocities uh, yes. in uh, Israel, killing babies, beheading babies. Uh, you know, this is uh, inhumane. Sri Thanedar, you, you tell me, when these rallies were being taken out, uh, was there no condemnation of the Hamas terrorism at all? Were they trying to justify it? How can you take out a rally? Uh, because many would say, well, you know, it was a rally in support of Palestine. Why can't we do it? So you tell us what made you take a decision and give out a statement that this is not something that you think was about a justified cause and that you cannot associate with it anymore. Well, this rally is about supporting Hamas. Hamas is a, a terrorist organization. U.S. Department of State has identified this organization as a terrorist organization. True. You know, and their actions uh, clearly show that. You know, they entered uh, Israel and they uh, really entered homes, took uh, innocent civilians, uh, killed families. Uh, killed babies, uh, you know, uh, capacitated babies, mm. deheaded babies. This is gruesome. And uh, anyone would even think about uh, glorifying and just, them. Just, Anybody, you know, even yeah. if not, like, irrespective of beheading or not, just killing children in cold blood in their cribs, taking them captive with young women, it's, it's worse enough. My final question to you, Sri Thanidhar, is how, uh, have you got support for the decision that you have taken? How is it being seen by other DSA chapters or around the world? Because in different parts of the Western world, and I remember uh, there were reports surfacing that outside the Sydney Opera House, which had lit up in Israeli colors, there was a protest with sloganeering of gas, the Jews and much worse. So, so yes, how is this being seen in the Western world right now? Well, this is a pure form of anti-Semitism. There is mm. this, you know, their anti-Semitism, their hatred for Jews is st so strong that they're blinded to the fact that these terrorists have performed atrocious act on innocent human beings. And, uh, uh, you know, that is the, what I, my resigning my membership in the Democratic Socialist uh, of America, I am bringing attention to their uh, hatred hmm. and anti-Semitism and how that is driving them to support a terrorist organization like Hamas.
It's an admirable step and uh, if it's wrong, it needs to be called out as well. But you've decided to resign from the membership and we'll see how this pans out, at, le at least for other rallies that were also taken out. And I know in Harvard University, statement of the student unions, many student groups have also retracted from their statement that they've started to after outrage over the sort of statement that was given solely blaming Israel for the attacks on Israel. I appreciate you joining us, Shri Thanidar. Uh, he's a U.S. congressman. He's uh, decided to resign from after a group organized a rally which appeared to be pro-Hamas. Thank you very much, Shri Thanidar.